Hey YouTube, it's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul and welcome to another remake video. Today we'll be remaking Drake's track God's Plan, so let's get straight to it. First things first, let's go ahead and set our tempo to 154 beats per minute. And we're going to start off with that main instrument, that main sound that we hear throughout the entire track. And we're going to bring in Logic's Vintage Mellotron. And let's go ahead and adjust this sound in a moment. We're just going to go ahead and draw in that pattern first. Let's go. So we're just going to go ahead and repeat that. And then let's draw in that next chord. All right, so here's that pattern. All right, let's go ahead and just duplicate that over. So let's get that sounding more like the one in the track itself. Let's go ahead and open up our Mellotron plugin. And for sound A, we're going to change this to a string selection. And for sound B, we're going to change it to three violins. We're going to push up our blend to about halfway point. Let's put the transpose on the string section here for sound A, up one octave. Let's lower our tape speed. lower our tone as well and just blast our volume. All right, next let's go ahead and bring in an EQ. Let's close this one over here. And now we're going to cut out a lot of the low end. Let's cut out a lot of the high end. Let's boost around this mid-range over here as well. All right, so there's our sound coming along together. Next, let's go ahead and open up an enveloper. Uh, we are going to go to Dynamics, and we're going to go to Enveloper. We're just going to soften up the attack a little bit. So let's go ahead and pull this all the way up. We're going to pull this down. And let's go ahead and just extend the, re the release a little bit. Let's go ahead and pull up this gain to about three quarters of the way up. Just stretches out that sound a little bit. Next, we are almost there. We're going to bring in a delay. So let's go ahead and uh, actually, before we bring in the delay, actually, I think we should bring in that chorus first. Let's go ahead to modulation and bring in chorus. All right, so we'll leave that glimmering chorus preset. Next, let's go ahead and bring in a delay. We're going to go with delay, tape delay. We're just going to use the default settings that load up. Let's just push the dry up to 100% and our wet value down to about 25. Next, let's go ahead and bring in some reverb. We're going to bring in Logic's new reverb plugin, uh, Chroma Verb. 
And here it is right here. Uh, let's see how this one sounds. Let's change it to Bloomy. Maybe we'll lower the dry a bit and maybe the wet a bit down as well. And that's pretty much the main sound right there. All right, next is going to create a new software instrument track. And we're going to work on that lead sound that you hear in the background, that super distorted lead sound. Uh, let's go ahead and bring in Logic's ES2 synthesizer. In a preset here, it's going to be the Drake The Weeknd filter bass synth that we did in a tutorial a long time ago. Go ahead and close that. And let's go ahead and draw in that pattern. I go to a nice high octave here. Let's lower that though. Good, just like that. Let's go ahead and just copy this over. We're just going to stretch out this last note over here. All right, next, go to open up our ES2. I'm just going to adjust the synth a little bit. We're going to bring up the attack. Let me bring up the release a little bit. Let's pull down the distortion because we're going to add a lot of distortion right now. Let's go ahead and open up an EQ. And uh, let's go ahead and cut out some of the lows. Cut out some of the highs. All right, it sounds good like that. Next, we're going to bring in some distortion. We'll bring in Logic's Overdrive. We're gonna blast this like crazy because it's super distorted and our tone will be around 2300. All right, so there is our sound right there. Next, let's go ahead and start getting to those drums. Let's go ahead and create a new software instrument track. And we're going to bring in Logic's EXS24 sampler instrument. And we're going to bring in the God's Plan drum kit I put together for this tutorial. And uh, let's start with an easy one. And we'll start off with the clap. Let's mute this one for now. So that's our clap, very simple. Next, let's go ahead to our hi-hat. And let's go ahead and just brush our hi-hats in. All 
All right, let's change that to an eighth note hit. Next, let's go ahead and duplicate this track and let's draw in our kick. Let's change this back to the pencil tool. Next, let's go ahead and duplicate this track. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and draw in a little percussion hit. All right, next let's go ahead and bring in sort of like a triangle sound and let's draw that in right now. All right, next let's go ahead and create a new softer instrument track. And we're gonna bring in Logic's Boutique 808 because this song needs some more cowbell. So we're gonna go Boutique 808. And uh, let's go ahead and draw in that one note hit. So that's good just like that. Next, let's go ahead and create a new software instrument track. And let's draw in our 808 pattern. We're gonna use Logic's ES2 synthesizer. And of course, we're gonna use that 808 preset we use in a lot of our remakes. Draw in a region. And let's uh, go to a nice low octave. All right, so let's go ahead and draw in that pattern. So we're gonna start over here. get a little sort of uh, up and down action happening over here. Let's go ahead and draw that in. ES2 synthesizer, and we're just gonna go ahead and adjust the sound over here. We'll start off by pulling up our attack to make it a little less clicky. Let's pull up our, or pull 
slowed down our sustain a little bit. Pull up the drive a little bit. Pull up our distortion a little bit. Let's just pull down the volume. That sounds good just like that. All right, so next let's go ahead and just get to arranging this track over here. Uh, so this main sound pretty much goes by itself for a little bit, but we're gonna shrink down the arrangement. Let's let it go for two bars. And then this lead sound comes into play just like that without the drums. All right, then this comes out and we'll let the beat go for on for a little bit here. And for the second half of this bar, we're going to sort of bring in this lead again. And then we're going to let this repeat. And let's go back just to this main sound and pull this back over here. And then let's just let the, uh, the beat ring out here, right out. All right, so that is a very quick arrangement. But sit back, relax, and enjoy, and listen to the remake we just put together, God's Plan by Drake. So that is how you remake God's Plan by Drake. For your Logic users out there, I'm gonna go ahead and save this entire session for you guys. Place that as a downloadable link in the description box below this video. For you non-Logic users out there, got your back as well. I'm gonna go ahead and export all these mini stems for you. I'm gonna export some of these loops and sounds for you guys. So you just drag it into your DAW and you have all the sounds that I have as well. I'm also gonna include a drum kit. You can find that entire play pack in the description box below this video. If you do have any questions on this, you can ask me in the comments below. And of course, for more great videos like this one, remember to hit that subscribe button and I'll talk to y'all soon. Later. Peace.